The eight macros and six new voice parameters are now available to modulate. They can be found in both mod matrix module and macro assign menus. Modulation of macros allows you to open up massive number of modulations with a single control movement. In an extreme case, you can have a single controller modulate all eight macros with all macros modulation field as well as modulation matrix slots field. This setup opens up the possibility to modulate up to 88 destinations at once to create extremely drastic sound change with a minimal movement. Here's one of the most common applications. You might find yourself playing a patch and turning a macro knob in a specific manner. And you like the sound of the modulation created by your hand movement. However, you would like to free your hand from the macro knob or save the movement to the actual patch. Now, you can simply set up a modulation to the macro knob and the job is done. First, let's create a modulation routing from envelope 5 to the macro knob by holding the envelope button and pressing the macro assign button. Now you will hear envelope 5 automating the macro, added to envelope to shape the control in different ways. The voice page has parameters added to the mod matrix now. The six modulatable parameters from the voice module include detune, analog fill, pitch band, vibrato amount, vibrato rate, and glide time. Modulation on unison's detune and analog fill enhance the sound shaping ability. In this example, I'm going to have the mod wheel control the detune and the aftertouch control the analog fill. The four remaining parameters can provide variation on performance over time or be further manipulated by other controllers. For example, map the mod wheel to control the glide time. 